new project give your project a name i'm going to call it firebase out select the language you want to use i'm going to use kotlin and i'm going to click finish give android studio some few minutes or seconds to finish configuring some libraries and dependencies once that is done the next thing that we are going to do is configure our custom theme to do so i'm going to go to less directory values and then i'm going to create themes.xml i'm going to remove the dark toolbar to no action bar then i'm going to go to colors and set my custom colors i'll just copy them and paste them here i'm going to replace the purple 200 and purple 500 finally i'm going to copy my resource folder that is the user icon and the lock icon copy them and paste them in your drawable folder remember those icons we are going to use them in designing the email and the password icons once uh, you are done adding your icons changing your theme and colors now we proceed and start creating activities we begin by creating our login activity so click layout new then activity and have your activity login here finish the next one would be register so activity and then have activity register then click finish and finally have dashboard so new activity empty activity and give it a name that is dashboard activity then click finish once you're done we are going to design our sign-in activity to look like our demo application sign-in activity so open your sign-in activity now we'll begin by creating linear route so i'm going to have a linear route here for the width i'm going to give it zero for the height i'm going to give it lab content i'm going to constrain it start start of palette and end of palette top top of palette and finally bottom bottom of palette remember the reason i'm using this constraint is because my palette layout is constraint layout so inside here i'll need to add Okay, let me give this one orientation to be vertical and i'm going to give it a start margin of 30 add margin 30. so inside it we are going to have title email input password input button and instruction for new user so i'll begin by creating these two so have your text input layout match palent lab content for the height inside this one have text input edit text match palent lab content give it input type which is a email address give it background current that will be hash zero 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 give it a hint that is email give it padding 16 and then we are going to add an icon in the beginning this one so i'm going to have drawable start and i'm going to have i see user and i'm going to give drawable padding 12. 
give it text color and my text color will be color input text finally i'm going to give it an id here and the id will be et email i'm going to copy this one paste it here below for password so i'm going to have et password name this one from email to password and then your drawable start will be lock since we are using password we need a way user can toggle like this one make the password visible and are uh, invisible so i'm going to have password toggle content description and this one will be password then add password toggle enabled give it true and have password toggle tint and give color ascent i'm going to give this on a top margin and i'm going to give it 20. then below it we'll need a button so have your button with match parent for height we are going to give it 60. the text give it login give it top margin I'm going to have 15 and we are going to have id and the id will be button login we need instructions here for a new user I'm going to define linear route and I'm going to lap content for the width and height. I'm going to give it orientation horizontal. Inside it, I'm going to have text view, lap content, lap content, and the text that I'm going to have is new here. And I'm going to copy this one, paste it down here and i'm going to say create account i'm going to give this on cara text cara and it will be cara text the whole of this layout i'm going to center it gravity center horizontal and i'm going to give it a top margin of 50 and padding i'm going to give it 10. so now we are going uh, to add our title for our activity register we want it to look like this uh, demo create account activity so what we are going to do we are going to copy these elements from activity login to save time so i'm going to copy this one Paste them in my activity register. And then I'm going to change the title to create account. Then I'm going to require the user to provide email, password, and then we can get confirm password here. So this will be confirm password. Now I'm going to have etc password. Then this button, I'm going to change the text and it will be create account. The instruction here for an existing user will be already have an account. Then I'm going to have sign in. So that's all we need for our activity register. Now let us finish designing our activity dashboard. For dashboard activity, we only need one text view. So have your text view here. Lap your content, lap your content. 
the text will be welcome and we are going to concatenate with the email of the send in user so let's give this one a constraint i'm going to have start start of parent i'm going to have end end of parent i'm going to have top top of parent and then bottom bottom of parent i'm going to give the text color here and the color even the size let's size 18 and color color text now we are done designing our activities so the next thing that we need to do is now start configuring firebase to our project 